All right, good morning, everybody. I've got two small groups set up. I've got our lesson set up. We're going to try something different today, and if it works, cool. And if it's, you know, a hot, chaotic mess, that's okay, too. No harm in trying something new, right? So the link is posted up on Google Classroom. I'm going to send it out to Class Dojo right now. And then once it's out to Class Dojo, we'll go ahead and turn that chat on. I hope you guys had a wonderful Thursday evening. We are trying to get everything up and running. We've been having some technical issues, but you know what? It's all good. We do the best that we can, and that's all that can be expected of us during this crazy, crazy time. It looks like I've got friends rolling into Mr. Rad's small group. So today our goal is not necessarily to try something new content-wise. We are going to attempt to do a review game. So if you have played Kahoot before, that's what we're going to try to do today. So I've taken some concepts, blended them together. We're going to be doing a quiz on Monday. So think of Monday as like your test. And today is going to review that. So I'm going to go ahead and turn that chat on. And I will see you guys in the chat. I'm going to try and do both. I'm not probably for this going to be able to do too much typing. Only because of what Kahoot's going to require me to do. So we'll see. Like I said, if today's a hot mess, today's a hot mess. It's fine. Alrighty, so I've got two small groups going. I've got all the things going. We're going to see how things go. All right, let's see who we got as you guys roll in. I'm going to go ahead. Oh, fantastic. All of my sixth grade maths are in. Yes, we're going to give some things a try. I don't know how it's going to go. Fingers crossed. We'll see. All right, so let's see who I've got in the box. Good morning, Ray and Jacob. I've got Kira, Katrina, Ashley. I've got Rara and Faiz. I've got Aiden, I've got Kaylee and Hanan, I've got Ty, I've got Lexi and Alexa. I've got Javier and Devin. I 
I've got Hamza and Khalees. I've got Micah, good morning. I've got DJ and Aya. I've got Zaleem and Zora, good morning. I've got Shelby. I've got Audric, good morning. Tiana, thank you. Good morning, friends. So we'll probably get started at about 8.10. Give friends time to roll in. Khadija, good morning. Bom dia, Guy. Good morning. I've got Avery and Kian, gentlemen. Good morning. All my Watsons, good morning. I know you're there. Bryce, Jesse, James, good morning. Good morning, Doreen. <laughs> so if you haven't said hello in the chat yet, go ahead and say hi. It lets me quickly mark you off. Ali, good morning. Looking for Michaela and Sama. Nils, if you're here, say hi. Miss Jenna, Josiah, say hi if you're here. And RC, if you're here, say hi. I would have uh, Kahoot in another tab ready to rock. The nice thing about doing YouTube versus uh, Zoom is that you can kind of alternate between listening and seeing me and going to Kahoot. So if you could have Kahoot ready to rock, that'd be great. Hello, Nils. Hi, Michaela. Hi, Josiah. No worries, Ashley. I was playing the same game. I had to tell Mr. Rad because I'm on my new computer over here. I have to let it fully die. So it's at 14%. So we'll see how long I last in the small group over here before it goes kaput. <laughs> Good morning, Sama. Beautiful, Zaleem. Good job. Yeah, Kahoot. You, well, I have Kahoot right now on my um, iPad, but you can roll it up on um, the computer too. You don't need to do anything as of yet. Because you don't have the code. I haven't shown you the code. The code hasn't generated yet. Um, so go ahead and just pull up Kahoot.com. Have it ready to rock. You could probably just Google it. That's fine too. And you know what? If it doesn't work, I've got the slides ready to go. So I'll give it one more minute. I'm still looking for... Jenna and RC. So if Jenna and RC can say hi, that would be cool. Jenna and RC, if you're here, say hi. Those are my only two friends I'm missing. Alrighty, so we'll go through. Let's go ahead and change academic to all well, two academic talk. Go ahead and type OK if you're ready to go. Let's go ahead and type OK if you're ready to go, and we'll go ahead and get started. Type hi in the chat once you hear your name. I've got Zaleem, Ali, Aya. I've got Rara and Zora and Aiden. I 
I've got Jacob Audric Hamza. I've got Ray, Kira, and Shelby. I've got Avery and Kian. I've got Kalise and Lexi. I've got Michaela and Sama. I've got Micah and Nils. I've got Ty and Javier. I've got Faiz and Hanan. I've got Devin and Tiana. I've got DJ and Alexa. Uh, Jenna, if you're here, just say hi. I've got Josiah and Kaylee. I've got Guy. Looking for RC. RC, if you're here, say hi. And I've got Ashley, Katrina, and Khadija. No, do not print the Kahoot thing. It's a lot of color and it's a lot of ink. Don't print it out. <laughs> do not print it out. It's a lot. It's not designed to be printed. Don't print it. <laughs> no, 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 no. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at what we're doing. Ah, oh, snap, I left my pen. Give me two seconds. I'm going to go grab my pen. Give me two seconds. back. There we go. There's our C. All right. So what we've got going on right now is we've got our reflex math and reflex math. Remember you're playing until the green light. Then from there, then from there, you've got your flip grid. Flip grid is a fun one today. You're going to go ahead and do pets 101. Just a fun Friday kind of video. I figured you guys have been really good this week with the really like academic y reading ones. We'd go ahead and do something fun. So if you've got a pet, introduce them. If you've got pets, introduce them. You can bring them on video. Um, it's up to you how you want to do it. If you don't have pets, that's fine too. Talk about your favorite animal. Maybe you want to talk about a pet that you'd like to have. Maybe you could talk about your favorite aquatic animal because, you know, I can't own an octopus, but I can talk about them. I can't own an elephant, but I could talk about them. So your choice in how you want to do the video, but you've got a minute and 30 seconds. So just make sure that it's not random, that you do have a structure to your videos. Oh, good, Micah. I'm glad. Yay. That makes me happy. Okay. Prodigy, you're going to do 20 questions minimum. If you want to see where you're at, go ahead and text me to figure out where you're at. So go ahead and text me if you want to figure out where you're at. I will announce the first, second, and third at 115. So I will announce first, second, and third at 115. Okay, so we are in math right now. We'll probably finish around 9, maybe 9.15. So completely on the fence there. Depends on how we do. A 
Literacy will come back at 1015. We're going to be reading about intelligent reptiles. And then science is at 110. I'm still working on getting us digital access. I'm still working on digital access. So 110, we'll do science. We are doing um, kind of like an impromptu experiment today. Um, so with that, I don't know. We're going to have to work because some of the hands-on experiments, some of the hands-on experiments, we're going to have to like come up with a workaround. So like we've got our first workaround today because technically it's an experiment we would do in the classroom. And so we're going to try and do a workaround today. So I'm still trying to figure out and I'm hoping I've got a call in to amplify today. Um, so hopefully we can get access today. Fingers crossed. I've got workarounds for science up through next week. And after that, I think we have to use the simulator. So I found a video on YouTube I guess we could use, but it's not nearly as fun as getting to play around with the simulator on your own. And then read aloud should be up right after this. I'm going to record it because this morning I was on the phone with Amplify. So um, I'll record the next series of chapters when we're done here. Okay. So in the box, if that makes sense, give me a chat emoji. So give me a text emoji if you're ready to start. Give me a text emoji if you're ready to start. Fantastic. All right, so let's give this a try, shall we? So you're going to go to Kahoot. You're going to go to Kahoot. I'll put the link in the box. You're going to hit log in. And you're going to log in with Google. We'll see how, or better yet, just hit play. I think that's a better option. I think you just hit play. So just hit play. There should be a screen that says enter game pin. So give me one second. So if you're here, if you're here, up in the top right corner, hit play. So give me an okay if you see the screen with the game pin. You should be hitting play. Play is in the top right corner to the left of sign up. So Micah, don't worry about it. Just hit play. Okay.
So when you log in, I don't know what's going to prompt you for a name. So go ahead and just put your initials. So if I was Shelby, I would put SF. If I was Javier, I'd put XM. So the pin So the pin is 3522995 Oh, thank you very much. Oh, man. I'm going to kick you out if you don't put your initials. I'm going to kick you out if you do not use your initials. I will kick you out if you do not put your initials. Okay, tap play, three, five, two, two, nine, nine, five. Is there anyone who isn't in? I think Guy is the only one we're waiting on. There's RC. All right, there we go. No, Ashley can still participate, though. Ashley can still participate, though. Ashley can still participate, though. Who is not in yet? Who is not in yet? Who is not in yet?
So that link nil should take you to the play screen and then enter three, five, two, two, nine, nine, five. Who is still not in? 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 I don't see an N. I'm looking for nils. Thank you, Jacob. <laughs> okay, Guy is in. I think we're waiting on nils. All right. Go, Guy, go. High fives. <laughs> All right. I didn't miss anything. I think we're just waiting on nils. I think we're just waiting on Nils. So Nils, it's in the chat. That should be to get you to the play screen where there's a game pin. The game pin is three, five, two, two, nine, nine, five. I think the only one who can't play is Ashley, but Ashley is still going to participate. Ashley is still going to participate. There we go. Nails, we're just going to leave you there. You're kind of in the same boat as RC, so you're good to go. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and presume everyone's in. Let's go ahead and start. So we are going to do some whole number place value. Here we go. We're going to do some whole number place value. So we're going to start here. We're going to start here. We're going to do a Kahoot quiz prep for the 48th Queendom. Citizens assemble. Again, that pin is 3522995. So take a look. This combines three or four different days together. These questions will combine information from four different lessons. Do not do not type the answer in the box. So take a look. Which number below has an eight that has a value one tenth as much as the eight in seventy eight thousand three hundred ten? Okay, so here you go. Here's your question. Which number below has an 8 that has a value one-tenth as much as the 8 in 78,310? Good. So, that's why there's a double screen. There is a double screen to give you more time to work out the problem. 
Does that make sense? It's not broken. I made a double screen. Okay. So, when you are ready, type OK in the box. When you are ready, type OK in the box. When you are ready, type OK in the box. When you are ready, type OK in the box. When you are ready, type OK in the box. And then get ready to push your button. Get ready to push your button. Here we go. Get ready to push your button. Which number below has a four that has a value one-tenth as much as the four in 546? Which number below has a four that has a value one-tenth as much as the four in 546? Good. Okay. Oh, Sama's coming up. Avery's coming up. Hams is there. Good job. So again, type, let's do this. Type a text emoji when you are ready. Type a text emoji when you are ready. I got Nils, got RC, got Lexi, Shelby, good, Jack, uh, Jacob. Type a text emoji when you are ready. So have the letter that you want to push ready to go when we get to the next screen. Okay, ready? Here we go. Which number below has a 1 that is 10 times as much in the 1 in 416, 937? So have the one that you want to answer ready to go. Good job, friends. We're starting to get it. Yay. Ooh, we have friends moving up. There's Ali. There's Lexi. Good job. Okay, so again, here's the screen. Here's the screen. Which number below has a 9 that has a value... Which number below has a 9 that has the value one-tenth as much as the 9 in 820,697? Look at where the 9 is sitting. Look at the place value. What place value is one-tenth of that place value? This is where you want to use your notebook. This is where you want to use your notebook. Wink, wink. Practice day. Use your notebook. Use your notes. Give me a text emoji when you are ready. Give me a text emoji when you are ready. Thank you, Zalim.
Oh, thank you, Nils. Thank you, Javier. Josiah, thank you. Guy, muy bien. Thank you. Ray, thank you. Thank you, thank you, friends. So, Jacob, have your uh, answer ready. Okay, ready? It should just be a click. If you know which one you're clicking, you should just be able to click it. Okay, quiz time. Here we go. Okay, you're going to click the color of where your letter was. So go ahead and click your answer. Good job, friends. Good job. All right, let's go next. Oh, Ali is on fire. Good job. Good job. All right, let's go to the next one. So which number below has a six that has a value 10 times as much as the six in 3,645? Which number below has a six that has a value 10 times as much as the six in 3,645? Think about the place value of where that six is and what's 10 times that place value. Where would that six need to be if it was 10 times as large? So give me an okay when you're ready. Have that number or letter ready to rock. So that way when we go to the next screen, you just have to hit. Have it ready to go. So that way when you go to the next one, you're good to go. If you don't need no more time, don't say no. Just if you need more time, let me know. Thank you, Lexi. Thank you, Aya. Javier, Jacob, thank you. Hamza, thank you. There's Avery, thank you. Thank you, Nils. Aya, thank you. Ali, thank you. Tiana, thank you. Ray, thank you. All right, here we go. Which number below has a six that has a value 10 times as much as the six in 3,645? Click the answer that you want. Hit the answer that you want. Good. Oh, excellent job, everybody. Oh, Lexi and Zaleem for the win. Catching up. Good job. Okay, so take a look. Prep your answer. When you have your answer ready, type a text emoji. Nope, RC, no stopping. You're still participating, please. When you have your re answer ready, type a text emoji. When you have your answer ready, type a text emoji. When you have that answer ready, type a text emoji. When you have that answer ready, type a text emoji. When you have that answer ready, type a text emoji.
Don't tell me, Avery, but do you have one? You touch it, and then we move. But I'm giving everyone think time here, and then they can pick. All righty, here we go. I'm going to move it. Here we go. Get your answer ready. Which number below has a 2 that has a value 10 times as much as the 2 in 56,382? Which number below has a 2 that has a value 10 times as much as the 2 in 56,382? Oh, good job, friends. Good job. Let's see who got it. Up here comes Hamza. Here comes Hamza. That's okay, RC. That's okay. So give me an okay. So which number below has a seven, one tenth as much as a seven and thirty-eight thousand seven and uh, seven hundred ninety-six? Blah blah blah. blah. <laughs> good, good, good. We'll wait for the rest of our friends. Thank you, Hamza. Thank you, Javier. So you want to look at the place value. What's one place of value lower? Okay, here we go. Hit your answer. Which number below has a seven that has a value one tenth? As much as the 7 in 38,796. Which number below has a 7 that has a value 1 tenth as much as the 7 in 38,796? Oh, good job, everybody. Oh, here comes Devin. All right, which number below has a five that has a value 10 times as much as the five in 874,502? Here, Guy. Oops. That's not going to be helpful. Here, Guy. Try that.
You are welcome. All right. If you are ready, give me a text emoji. If you are ready, give me a text emoji. Thank you, Gee. Beautiful. All right, you ready? Here we go. Which number has a five that has a value 10 times as much as the five in 874,502? Look at those answers rolling in, we're rolling in. Boom, 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 boom. Avery, click the button. Quick, quick, quick. Click the button. <laughs> Hit the button now. We've got a screen specifically for Think Time. Oh, very good, everybody. Oh, Lexi's rolling up. Here comes Zaleem. Here comes Devin, Zora, and Hamza. Well done, everybody. Okay, next one. Remember, think time. Think time. So figure it out. Good job, Ashley. Good job. I know. Remember, if it's not working, you can still play. This is your assignment today. So if you're getting them wrong, I'm going to be keeping friends afterwards. If you want me to go through the problems and explain them, that's fine. I don't mind. When you're ready, give me a text emoji. Which number below has a three that has a value one-tenth as much as the three in 436? Look at where that three is sitting. What would be one place value less? And then go find a number where that three is sitting in a place value that is one place value left. Or one place value less. Not left. Haha, <laughs> less. It's definitely not to the left. <laughs> You're not pulling a Beyonce. You're not going to the left to the left. Not with one tenth. It'd have to be ten times. All right. Muy bien, Guy. Very good. Very good, sir. Muito bom. Very good, Guy. Very good. Does anyone need more time? Does anyone need more time? All right, here we go. Get ready to put your answer in. Get ready to put your answer in. Get ready to put your answer in. Here we go. Put your answer in. Quick, quick, quick. No stalling. Pick whichever one you think it is. What did you work it out to be? Oh, good job, friends. We're doing mostly good. That's awesome. Ooh, we got a close battle between Lexi, Zalim, Devin, Zora, and Hamza. Okay, next one.
Good job, Ashley. Ha, muy bien, Guy. Muy the bomb. Very good. Yay. Which number below has a one that has a value one tenth as much as the one in 816,259? Remember, look at where that one is. Identify the place value. What's the place value to the right? And go find a number in that place value. This is patterns. This is place value. This is base 10. We'll give it till about 8.54 and then we'll move. Good job, Josiah. So 8.54, we'll move. 8.54, I'll push the button. Here we go. Get your answer ready. Here we go. Which number below has a one that has a value one tenth as much as the one in 816,259? Avery, it's fine. Ashley can't either. You can still play, though. You just can't push a button. It's fine. Yay, good job. Ooh, here comes Sama again. Sama's coming up. Okay, here we go. Type an emoji when you are ready. Type an emoji when you are ready. Good job, Shelby. Way to persevere. Yay, good job. Way to persevere. <laughs> like I said, this is our first time doing Kahoot in this format. If it's a dumpster fire, it's a dumpster fire. It's fine. But I think for the most part, everyone's good. Yes, Jacob, yes. Trying is all we can ever expect you to do. Good job. Perseverance, my friends. Working through the struggle. If I didn't work through the struggle, we wouldn't be doing Kahoot right now. It took me a while to figure it out last night, and that's okay. <laughs> we wouldn't be doing science right now because that's been a <laughs> hot mess too. So it's all good. We try. And when we try, we learn. It's a growth mindset. Setting the example. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're going to go till 857. 857, I'll push the button. Eight fifty seven, I will push next. All right, 857, I'm pushing the button. 857, I'm pushing the button. Here we go. Hit your button. Hit your button. 
Good job, everybody. Good job. Oh, excellent. Look at that. Good job. High fives. Nicely done. Let's see what the points look like. Ooh, we've got such a close battle between Lexi, Zaleem, Devin, Zora. Good job. Well done, everybody. Okay, here we go. Which number below has a three that has a value one-tenth as much as the three in 937,184? Which number below has a three that has a value one-tenth as much as the three in 937,184? All righty, so you're looking at one-tenth less. Remember when we're dealing in fractions, one-tenth means you're going one place value lower. If it's 10 times, you're making a place value larger. So one-tenth is one place value lower. 10 times is one place value higher. So one-tenth, you're going lower. 10 times, you're going bigger. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Which number below has a three one tenth as much as the three in 937,184? So one tenth as much as 937,184. Oh, look at you. Fantastic. Good job. High fives, everybody. Nicely done. Here we go. Let's see if we shift. Oh, look at that. Good job, friends. Oh, Tiana, you got four in the row. High fives, Tiana. Nicely done. Four in a row. We're getting that pattern. Good job. Okay. Which number below has a seven that has a value one tenth as much as the seven in 27,106. Remember, one tenth means you're going the place value lower. One place value lower. One place value lower. So if you were doing 10 times, 10 times would be one higher. One tenth, though, is one place value down. Good job, Gee. Well done. At 9.03, I will hit next. At 9.03, I will hit next. Give everyone time to figure it out.
Oh, good, Ashley. I'm glad. I was, wasn't was sure how we would do, but I'm glad we're liking it. So after we do 1.2 topic, we'll do this again. There's a whole bunch of them now, so it's fine. And this wasn't too hard to do. It just took, it was just time consuming. So. Nine oh three, you're ready to put your answers in. Nine oh three, you're ready to put your answers in. Nine oh three, get ready to put your answers in. Here we go. Which number has a seven that has a value one tenth as much as the seven in twenty seven thousand one hundred six? Which number has a value or has a seven that has a value one tenth as much as the seven in twenty seven thousand one hundred six? Good. We're getting it. Oh, here comes Zora and Zaleem. Oh, snap, Zora Zaleem. Zora's got the highest streak of 11 in a row. Well done. High fives to you. Look at that. Okay, let's go. Here we go. So 906, I will hit it. 906, I will hit it. So 906, I will hit the button. Which number below has a four that has a value 10 times as much as the four in 501,468? Which number below has a four that has a value 10 times as much? So 10 times as much, one place value up. So 906, I'm hitting next. Nine oh six, I'm hitting next. Nine oh six, I'm hitting next. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Which number below has a four that has a value 10 times as much as the four in 501, 468? Get your answers in. I see them rolling in. Good job. Get your answers in. Ah, good job, everybody. Ooh, here comes Ali, making three in a row, making moves. Ooh, it's Salim and Zora, neck and neck. Salim and Zora, neck and neck. Here we go. Which number below has a six that has a value ten times as much as the six in 362,859? 
Which number below has a 6 that has a value 10 times as much as the 6 in 362,859? All right, 909 will move. So get your answer ready. 909 will hit the button. Get your answer ready. Which number below has a 6 that has a value 10 times as much as the 6 in 362,859? All right, here we go. Last one. Which number below has a six that has a value 10 times as much as the six in 362,859? <laughs> here we go. Here we go. Which number below has a six that has a value 10 times as much as the six in 362,859? Oh, that's brilliant. Yes, yes, yes. Good job. High fives. Yeah, that's great. Look at you guys. Oh, that makes me happy. I'm getting goosies. <laughs> Yay. All right, let's see. We got podium. Do, 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 do. Lex, you got 13 out of 15. Good job. Then we got Zora. And coming in first is... Da, 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 Zalim. Round of applause. That's great. Good job. And in fourth place was Devin. And in fifth place, AR. Who had AR? Oh, that was Alexa. Look at you. Yeah, go Alexa. We got some fourth graders coming in clutch. Good job. And check that out. Every question was answered correctly by the majority of us. Well done. Good job, everybody. That was great. All right, so let's log on back. So take a look, everybody. You got recess coming up, 915 to 945. We are going to come back. We got two more classes to go. So we've got 1015. I will see you back here. This updated last night. I don't like it. I miss my pens. So I will see you at 1015. I will see you at 10. 15. I will see you at 10. 15. I'm going to go ahead and shut down the chat. I will see you at 10. 15 for literacy. All right. Bye, everybody. I'm going to go ahead and turn the chat off. So go take a break. Get your wiggles out. Uh, get your radical reptiles ready to rock. We're going to be annotating and then we'll get to do something new next week with it. All right. I'll see you guys soon. I'm going to go ahead and turn the chat off. Bye, friends.